Greetings from Snake Mountain Boat Works on Thursday, June 29. We've made some progress and thought we'd share with you this step. After each plank is on, and before the next one can go on, lay down a, a masking strip of blue painter's tape. And this keeps the 5200 from spreading onto the plank that's already down. See, now we're, we're putting in one of the planks that's pretty significantly curved. And we have to start at the nose and work back. I'd be up there helping with this, but somebody has to run the video camera. So we got the second chunk of this plank. Here, I'll break down. consuming process though. Oh, hours and hours and hours. Thousands and thousands of them. Number eight, silicon bronze, Ferguson head, whiskers. And pretty close to hundreds of tubes of 5200 by the time we're done. And as you can see that as John and RJ begin sinking the screws, the squeeze out is quite substantial. And all of this will be cleaned with uh, Interlux 333 special thinner. And a huge pile of rags. Lots of tape. <laughs> and lots of tape. And lots of gloves. Boxes of them. I think we're on our third box already. Third box of gloves already? I'm not surprised. But by starting out the screws the way you are, at least we don't have fountains of 5200 spoiling all of our tools and even more gloves. So we'll keep on working, get this side done, get it cleaned, and be back to you when we start on laying down the planks on port. Thank you so much. Bye-bye for now from Snake Mountain Boatworks.